Hello, welcome back to The Batch of the Bad Variety, episode 3. Um, so last time we, uh, we met, was it Cut, was his name? The, uh, the deserter who uh, managed to get off world, and the Batch tried to, well, Hunter at least tried to get rid of, uh, Amiga. Um, but, um, she's coming with, she's along for the journey, and... I'm very interested in where she ends up, because she should she could easily be a character that's now put all throughout Star Wars. And maybe even live action? I don't know. But yeah, let's uh, let's watch this thing. Ugh. Replacements. Ah, it's for the ship. Ain't doing too good. This poor gonk, he's just abused. Mmm, a yummy oh, stick. You can have mine. Hey, Omega doesn't even have a place to sleep. You want to take her food too? Oh, oh. Uh, no, no thanks. You keep it. Oh, <laughs> Rekka. Okay. Yeah, I guess I'm not used to having a kid around here. Well, none of us are. No, oh, they're all dads She's now. Testing the functionality of our inhibitor chips takes precedence. Well, I thought you said that ah. it's A theory this device will be able to prove. Maybe try put on crosshair? Ooh. I'd say that's pretty critical, Tech. It's not yeah, critical. you got lucky that you didn't We're smash into that planet. Me? The power capacitor's blown. A crash landing? Now it's Clone Wars. Get ready for your first crash landing! <laughs> I'll make a strap in. No, the gonk! I hope he doesn't die. The gonk's fine. Thank God. Oh yeah, and a wrecker and Omega. Is it over? Right now we need to find that capacitor and get off this rock. I can see Crosshair dying, but I really hope he doesn't. And oh, we're back at Camino. He is their winter soldier. Governor Tarkin. Hope I'm not interrupting you. Right on schedule, Rampart. He was implementation has been most successful. Yeah. He was the guy in the hologram last episode. Indeed. Our top recruits are here to begin their training. Under their new commander. Oh. Commander Crosser? Requires an increase in soldiers to maintain order throughout the galaxy. The Kaminoans are gonna May I somehow foil your plan, right? First elite squad. Ooh, that isn't um. Top no, okay. Let's go see. Is that the girl from More Battlefront Two? I've got her name. Clones. Together, they would make a formidable army. Hey, it's like. Uh, what Hyan had on the asteroid. Careful, those capacitors hold massive charge. Let's hope there's no mine knocks. I am well aware. Oh, I'm well, there's something. It. As long as it's not those giant spider things again. Yeah. Well, that looks terrible. Don't be the guy who looks into the egg and alien. Like, oh, what's this? Don't uh, why 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 does it go for that? Uh. What's wrong with you? It's fun seeing Amiga try stuff for the first time. Crash. The capacitor's in place, but other systems are now failing. Something something wrong with his chip. Exterior hull. You want to narrow that down? It's like a Minoc. What? What is it? Rekka, stay here. Hmm. The dragon and get our part back. They're gonna have to use um. Your stay. Text like headset thing. I'm part of the squad now too, right? Okay, but also gotta know how to fight properly. That's a big deal. Close. I hope she don't get captured or like she causes a bunch of trouble. 
I was saying last episode, so far I don't mind her, but she better not cause trouble every episode. I get fed and I have a roof over my head. That's more than the Republic ever did for me. Good, I want to see more of this side. Like, conscripted recruits will never reach the There was a lot of jobs created with the Empire, and some worlds, like, were better off. have been trained since their creation. A tangible test is in order. We need to see them in action. Tarkin and his tests. Send the clone and your recruits to Onderon. I want Sorgareda's camp found and wiped out. So Tarkin's test is sending people to kill, like, women and children. Like, who will do it? Good job, Tarkin. Yep, that's Moondust. Good. We don't always get to see Hunter's ability because it's like very specific, so I'm glad we are. Oh dear. I mean, these people are soldiers at least. Uh. Oh, oh boy. Get our people on the shuttle, now! How big are you? Hello! Oh, jeez. Um... That's a Rex pistol there. You know it's reliable. Hey, Omega. You can do this. You're just heading in? What could go wrong? Oh, screw that. Nope. Terrible. Yeah, it's a little massacre going on. He's like Kindy Mundy on Geonosis. Oh, that's terrible. Guerrero's fighters are dead. These are civilians. Hmm. Those weren't our orders. Forget our orders. This is wrong. Wow. So you're not going to comply. We're going to detain the prisoners and take them in for questioning. And sure. They put me in charge. Yep. Well then, that uh, kid show, kids animation. It's not attacking. Oh, okay. See, he's not too bad. He wants to play catch. There we go. Who's a good boy? Some cool lighting. I tracked the dragon, like you did. Is that my blaster? Saying I tracked it like you did, is that a hint that she has his powers as well? Enhancements? Because it has seemed like she has a little bit of everything. Well, not everybody do. We've seen. Uh, we've seen uh, a sharp shooting skills. Down. If Rampart has his way, conscripted soldiers will make clones obsolete. Hmm. The original genetic material from Django Fat continues to degrade. Then it is time to begin the next phase. If your experiment can Palpatine be clones, clone, it will secure our relationship with this empire. Our survival hinges on it. I'm very curious where that's going to lead, this plotline. Making new clones that are, like... We don't know any other clones other than Palpatine, but I, I don't think... Th I think it's a probably a bit too soon for that, right? Okay. Open them! <laughs> Check it out! Oh, a little bedroom! Oh, Wrecker. Papa Wrecker. It's your 
own room. And his little bunny. Thank you, Ricker. No. nothing. <laughs> well, you're part of this squad now too. Look at these dads doing their job. I want each one of them to have a moment with her. This is Wreckers. Oh, what a sweet ending. Alright, episode three. I really enjoyed that episode. It was... It, I think it's the most I've enjoyed Omega so far. You know, like, we've seen her... Well, we saw her get stuff done. She got that power source. But also moments like this where you're reminded it's, she's just a child. She's going to bring the best out of the Bad Batch, I think. Which is really good. And then Crosshair, I mean, it feels like they're hinting like they can change him. Like, he's either going to die, or he's going to be changed back. There's only one of those two options, and the more bad stuff Crosshair does, the more it seems like he'll die, or have to, like, sacrifice himself to save them all. Because, you know... At what point do you think, okay, there's no coming back from this? Like, he murdered civilians already, that's, it's pretty damn bad, but if he does even worse than that, which I feel like he will before the end of this, it's hard to say. But we did have text, like, hint of, like, he's building a scanner for the chips, and Wrecker's head was hurting, which maybe it was to do with the crash, because it wasn't brought up at the end here, but to me it feels like something to do with the chip. Maybe it's just sort of damaged and hurting his brain a bit. I could see maybe one of them, the chip just sort of clicks, and suddenly they become bad, but they have to quickly fix them. Maybe? Because there's no, like, at the moment, clear path of where this show's going, which I don't think's a problem. Like, I can never tell, okay, next episode, this is what's gonna happen. Like, Omega said, like, we're gonna get Crosshair back, but I don't know how they think that's going to happen. they got to somehow lure him out. And then what I find probably the most interesting thing is the plot with the Kaminoans. Because it's just one of those things I never thought about. Oh yeah, the Empire just sort of screwed them over because clones are no longer a thing. They said, we're going to make a new batch of clones that are just like so good the Empire can't turn them down. And from what we know, there are no clones in the future. No stormtroopers are clones. So, how's that going to come back around? I don't know. Anyway, that's another solid episode. And, you know, for season one, it's doing pretty damn well. Because season one of Clone Wars is, like, eh, compared to the rest of the show. And season one of Rebels, I really didn't enjoy, even though I really enjoyed the rest of it. Um, but this is just a solid start. And uh, until next time, farewell.